Mahatma Gandhi, father of our great nation, had an enduring concern for people afflicted with leprosy. His vision was not to treat them, but also to mainstream them in our society. Our efforts to eliminate leprosy from this country under the National Leprosy Eradication Program is just a tribute to his vision. This program was launched way back in 1955. The goal of leprosy elimination as a public health problem that is prevalence rate of less than one case per 10,000 population at national level was achieved in 2005. Although the case detection rate thereafter has marginally decreased. Visible deformiting at the time of diagnosis has increased. This suggests that cases are being detected late. As a country, we have to leave no stone unturned to not just reach the last mile, but also to work together to eliminate the social stigma attached with this disease. A three-pronged strategy for early detection of leprosy cases in the community was introduced in 2016 under the National Health Mission, especially in the hard-to-reach areas. A special leprosy case detection campaign was carried out in 2016. As a result, more than 32,000 cases were confirmed and were put on treatment. In addition, persons who are in close contact with the patients were also given medicine to reduce the chances of occurrence of the disease in these people. Although we have achieved our target at the national level, we have a long, arduous way to go to ensure that this treachable disease is completely eliminated in our country. We also have to work together for socio-economic upliftment of the cure persons and for their contribution in nation building. We have to strive hard to ensure that these citizens of our country lead a life with dignity that Mahatma Gandhi dreamed of. In this context, I'm happy to note the work being done by the Nippon Foundation that is organizing the launch of Global Appeal 2017 to end stigma and disc discrimination against people affected by leprosy. Thank you.